Good morning guys, Frank here at Bell Dodge Kia pre-owned in Saco, Maine. Today I have a very quick video walk around of our 2021 Toyota RAV4 XLE. This RAV4 is in the midnight black metallic finish with 17 inch gloss black alloys, which just look phenomenal, gives you a nice blacked out look. This is powered by a 2.5 liter four cylinder, combined MPG is 30 miles a gallon with an impressive 203 horsepower. Walk around the back for us real quick. Open up the power tailgate. Oh, I unlocked the vehicle. That'd be good if I open it actually. There we go. Gotta find the right button. Here back here, you do have your privacy screen, which can't be removed if you so choose, as well as your compact spare tire underneath. You get a nice 60-40 rear split seat, give you ample enough, sorry, an ample it would be good if I had morning coffee. Sorry, guys. 63 cubic feet of storage with your seats down. Wow. I'll get back to it. You get a nice little court cubby space of bin right here with a standard 12-volt cigarette lighter outlet. Go ahead and pop down this tailgate. This does have a towing capacity of 1,500 pounds. Now, as long as the key is on your person, put your hand behind the door handle and a power unlock for us. Driver side, you get this nice padded armrest with your mirror and window controls on your door handle. Decent size bin underneath. You're also getting driver's side power eight-way seat with two-way lumbar support. Before we hop into driver's side, check out the rear seat. You do get all weather mats throughout. Let's go ahead and hop on in. Two USB ports down below with your AC vents. Now this seat is where I would sit comfortably. I'm a 5'8 male, pretty average height, average build, ample enough leg room. But nice large wide center armrest with cup holders. You see, so you can see a nice cloth with dual tone colors, black and dark gray. Nice design on them and super soft actually. Now let's go ahead and hop on in the driver's side. It's rather cold out today, so I'm gonna get the engine going. Rav4. Then as you can see, you have a hair under 21,000 miles on it. So it still has the remaining Toyota powertrain warranty from the manufacturer, as well as our lifetime powertrain. We'll go over that more in person. By your driver's left knee, you do get a heated steering wheel, which is currently on because I am freezing, tailgate control, uh, auto high beams, and then your rear wiper. And then on the left side of the driver's wheel, you do get your hands-free Bluetooth as well as the toggle between the screen you see in front of the driver. And then on your right, you do get your media controls for forward and back, cruise control, as well as your adaptive cruise control and then your lane departure warning. Now this is powered by a seven inch touchscreen, AM, FM, satellite radio, obviously Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, which is always nice with a six speaker surround. It's actually a pretty impressive standard uh, radio system powered by Mr. Clean. <laughs> Underneath that, you do get dual climate controls as well as heated front seats. And then a pretty large deep bin for phone, phone placements or what have you. USB and another 12 volt. And now you get your drive mode selector buttons right here. Obviously, they correspond to what they do. And then a nice padded large armrest. Decent side storage inside with more USB ports. And obviously up top, we do have a nice moon roof, sunglass holders. And I always like these SOS buttons Toyota puts in them. I think it's pretty funny that you have a little cover. You don't want to hit that because that is your SOS, but yeah, it's pretty funny. Again, just a very quick video walk around. Check out these seats again. Extremely soft, comfortable. Again, any questions on this or anything else on my lot, please use my information down below. My name is Frank, and I want to thank you guys for watching.